Hello, I'm Emily Spaven. This is your Week in Tech. In investment news, UK AI startup Luminance raised $3 million from Invoke Capital. The company has released a system that can read through reams of papers, flagging up potential issues during mergers and acquisitions. Customer service automation platform Contact Engine raised £2 million from Amadeus Capital and Berengia, while Kite raised £1.4 million in a round led by Longwall Venture Partners. Sapphire Ventures announced the closure of a $1 billion fund to invest in tech startups worldwide. Although based in the US, the firm will seek to invest a portion of its funds in the EMEA region, with a focus on the UK and Israel. Three more UK banks have enabled Android Pay support. NatWest, Santander and RBS customers can now add cards to their Android smartphones to make contactless and online payments. Canadian business software firm OpenText is set to buy Dell Technologies Enterprise Content Unit for $1.62 billion. Barclays acted as the financial advisor for the deal, providing a $1 billion debt commitment in support of the transaction. Our download of the week is Memrise. It's a mobile learning platform designed to gamify language learning and make it fun and accessible for all. It features courses in more than 200 languages and enables you to track your progress against that of your friends. And finally, fed up of waiting at the bar to be served another drink? Martini's Smart Ice Cubes could help. The electronic cubes sit in your drink and notify bar staff when they get to the bottom and you're ready for another tipple. Pretty cool, but probably pretty lethal for your bar tab. That's all for this week. For more of the latest technology news, visit our website and follow us on Twitter.